Today I'm going to make homemade Nutella. Uh oh. So I saw this on YouTube and the idea is that after you roast the hazelnuts, you put them between a towel and rub them together and the skin comes off. My hazelnuts were already roasted and I was hoping for that trick to work a little bit better than it did. So I spent a little bit more time on this than was necessary. It was a mindless activity and I didn't mind doing it. And you can see that I'm trying to rub the skin off the towel. I can hear Linda behind me eating some nuts and it sounds like she's really enjoying hazelnuts. So a little backstory, as I was thinking about what would be fun to make over Christmas, I thought hazelnut coffee, the real deal, would be really fun to drink. But I decided to make real Nutella at home and try to make it with less sugar instead. I was so excited to eat this Nutella. This is a really great mindless activity to keep your hands busy, but it is unnecessary. I would just do a quick run through with the towel because more than that, it's just kind of a waste of time. So I'm gonna speed this prep work up a bit and then go right to the mixing. So I think partly why my expectation is so high is because I made hazelnut milk from real hazelnuts a few years back and it was so delicious. It was so good. I just savored every bit of it. So it's not as smooth as it could be because I'm using the wrong blade attachment. Magic Bullet has a flat blade attachment that would have been way better for this, but I lost mine. So I added vanilla extract, a little bit of water to get it to mix. Here's the cocoa powder and I'm 
adding stevia as well. And then later I'll add some coconut creamer. giving it a final mix here and it's ready to taste. So first taste test, it's not really meeting my expectations. I thought it would be pretty amazing. So maybe a cracker will help. I know exactly what it needs. It needs melted chocolate. So I added a little of Hershey's chocolate. I ended up making a pumpkin cake and I put the hazelnut on top of it with the melted chocolate and it was super delicious. I will post that video soon.